What's going on guys, it's Inspector Freck here, and today I'm bringing you a domination gameplay on the map Bootleg. And it's Monday, so you know what day that is. It's in, it's a Would You Rather Day. And that means I'm joined today by my special guest, Danielle. Hi guys! Right, and we were originally joined by uh, our new uh, kitten. kitten, but uh, he decided he's going to fall asleep behind the computer chair. So, yeah, he's not going to be joining us today. Not like he'd mm -hmm. say much. But, um, anyway, let's get ahead and get to it. Our first question is actually from one of you guys. It's from Blur Phantom. His question was, would you rather have x-ray vision or bionic hearing? Okay, in the in this last week we've talked about this a lot. Mm -hmm. Putting in the different circumstances. And if it's one that we can control, like ideally, contr control like everything, like, oh, I'm going to look through this wall or I'm going to hear into the next room, then... I would choose bionic hearing. And what if you can't control it? If I can't control it, then I want x-ray vision. I'd rather see naked like girls and guys than hear every moan, groan, crying baby. But that means you would have to see every naked girl and guy. Like, like I the, will take the chances. Like the fat, like a like big lady in Walmart. Or you'd have to look at big lady naked in Walmart. I will take it. Oh. You want to hear? You want to hear Michael having sex with? Uh, that's why my both my options are both X-ray vision. My, so gonna, so you're gonna see naked people just as much as I am. So why are you giving me shit about seeing naked people? Because I don't understand why. If you're already going the 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 sound option, I don't know. Understand why you're going. In the worst of circumstances, the vision. The vision, yeah. Because you can close your eyes and stop seeing shit. Yeah, but you can't walk around with your eyes closed all the time. I'm going to try. <laughs> I'm not helping you. Okay. If you're forced to look at everyone naked, I'm going to walk you around Walmart all the time. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm going to go with both ways, x-ray vision. I just, uh, I just, I, I, can't stand, I can't stand hearing people talk as it is. I don't like, I, I can't stand the idiocracy that comes out of people's fucking shitholes. So... Yeah, I'm gonna go with X-ray vision. Well, you also want X-ray vision because your sight sucks. Oh yeah, yeah. I can't, I can't see to save my life. But um, anyway, next question: Would you rather wake up next to a dead horse or wake up next to Charlie Sheen? Ugh. Okay. Well, Charlie Sheen is a woman beater. A dead horse. Well, it's dead. Are we implying that I'm fucking it the night before? Or? Both. We're, yeah. We're implying you're fucking, like... I killed yeah. the horse one sex, yeah. and, um... Uh, well, I guess I'm having sex with Charlie Sheen. And if I'm not having sex, and I'm just somehow waking up next to one of them... But, see, it's not fair to... I know where you're going with this. <laughs> it's not fair to assume that, Char that you brought up the whole Charlie beating women thing. That's not fair to him to assume that you're gonna be you're gonna get the shit kicked out of you as soon as you wake up. That's like okay, that's like me going, would I rather sleep next to Charlie Sheen or Well, you know you know who I'm thinking. Okay, but none of the none of which are implying. I'm not saying you're gonna wake up next to a dead you're gonna fuck a dead horse to death. You're gonna fuck a horse to death, or you're gonna wake up and get the shit kicked out of you by Charlie Sheen. I'm okay. just saying would you ra it's just would you rather wake up next to him? I'm still gonna pick the dead horse. Okay. I don't want to listen to Charlie Sheen and his rambles on how he's by winning and how he, he has tiger blood. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, I'm going to go with both ways, Charlie Sheen. Yeah, you want it in your butt. Nope, nothing goes in my butt. I'm going to go with Charlie Sheen because, first of all, I'm giving, not taking. Nothing goes in my butt, you know that. So, kit in your back. You going to say hi to everyone? Go away. We're doing a commentary right now. Uh, I'm gonna go like uh, like this because if he, well, bless it, we have sex. Me and him have sex. Then I'm divorcing you. Oh, it's come on, I have a <laughs> If me and him have sex, then I can get a shitload of money. I could turn around and sue and get a whole lot of money for Charlie Sheen. And I know he's not exactly the richest man on earth anymore, but I can get a shitload of money out of him. So, yeah. All right, next question. Would you rather lose your arms or lose your legs permanently? Permanently? Yes. Like, can't use prosthetics afterwards? Yep. I'm going to go with losing my legs 
Because everything I do involves my hands. Mm. Yeah. Everything I do involves my hands. Uh, I wonder how it would be. I guess it would be where mm. your legs are cut off at. I was gonna say. I wonder how sex would be if you have no like. If, no, not for like if. I wonder how it would be if I had sex with you and you had no legs. That would suck. I can't picture that. I wonder if they have prosthetic leg porn. <laughs> we should look it up. <laughs> uh, what about you? What would you... Uh, I'm going to go with uh, no legs because here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to change my name legally right away. But the first day it happens, I get out of the hospital. I'm going to change my name legally to first name Lieutenant, last name Dan. And I'm going to grow out my hair. I'm going to just go around the whole my whole rest of my life quoting Forrest Gump mo- the, the uh, Lieutenant Dan's lines in Forrest Gump just all day long your dad would be cracking jokes oh, oh, you get your jazzy chair oh, no because Lieutenant Dan ain't no bitch he uses a real chair <laughs> yeah but oh but then he gets his he gets his legs yeah but you can get a jazzy chair yeah my, that's not defeats the point of me taking over Lieutenant Dan's personality I don't care you still get a jazzy chair you were so excited for one like years ago okay next question would you rather be a chronic farter or a chronic burper? Meaning, uh, chronic defining, uh, you're going to either burp every 10 seconds or you're going to fart every 10 seconds. And I'm talking both would be, you know, very loud, audible, like movie style farts or burps. I think I'm going to go with chronic burping. Mm-hmm. Because farting smells really nasty. They linger like there's no tomorrow. And I don't want to smell yours, nor do I want to smell my own. So I'm gonna go with burping. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go with burping too, because you can't. You can play off chronic burping like it's like a form of Tourette's. You can't play off chronic farting, and you could play off as Tourette's, but you couldn't play off as acceptable Tourette's. I mean, you could have bad breath, but you're. I haven't smelled a good fart ever. Even my own aren't necessarily. You know, something I'd want to smell every 10 seconds. Yeah, you smell pretty bad. Like, yours aren't exactly roses either, do you? Oh, I know. I know. <laughs> all right. Let's move on. I really want to get to this oh, next one. Oh, these are disgusting. Uh, all right. <laughs> Would you rather go down on your grandpa, you know, meaning suck his dick, or would you rather have your grandmother go down on you? Want me to go first? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm not for the... You know, I'm like... Uh, you know, Don't get me wrong. If you're gay, do whatever you want. But I personally am completely straight. Uh, I'm sorry. I don't give a shit. Grandma, I'm sorry. Uh, you know what? To make it worse, I'm going to pick the dead one. I'm going to pick my dead grandma. I'm going to let her... <laughs> you can't. It has to be alive. It, has to, it doesn't... All right, fine. I guess nan- Nanny's going down on me then. I'm not... I don't... I'm sorry. No male-to-male contact will happen with me. Okay? Unless it's Charlie Sheen. <laughs> if it's Charlie Sheen, then I'm okay. Okay. Um. Come on. I guess I'm having Grandma go down on me. Really? <laughs> yeah. I'm not going down on Grandpa. What if he's hung? I don't care if he's hung. He's got all wrinkly. He's got saggy balls. And I stuff. don't. No, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. You sure? Yeah, I'm having Grandma go down on me. Okay. At least I can pretend it's someone else. Okay. All right, this next one here, I like this. Would you rather watch your parents doing it a thousand times? I'm going to say in person. Or would you rather join in on them once? Okay, there's no thinking about that one. I would rather watch them do it a thousand times than join in once. That is completely disgusting. Yeah, I would think you would... See, here's the problem I see, is that that kind of scars you and then... Like, uh, you have to, like, that's something you have to deal with over and over again, a thousand times. You get a sex addiction after that. Yeah, but I, like I said, if you fuck them once, you could just never, t- like, not both of them, you not fucking both of them, but, like... You're joining in on I know. having sex. I know, like, if I... If so, you, so, let me, let me put it this way. You want male-to-male contact with your dad? No. It's not necessarily like that. Um... Uh, I'm going to have to go with not answering this question. I'm not doing either. Uh, I know my mom listens to this channel, so I'm not freaking answering this question. 
All right, anyway, guys, that was Would You Rather. Uh, we had to wrap it up early, and uh, I end up going whatever in this game. And we'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.